Alright, so a lot of you are probably wondering whether or not it is possible to boot the Android device on an iPhone. This is my iPhone 3G. And let's go ahead and power it down. With iBoot, it goes ahead and uh, installs a new boat, uh, bootloader. see it right now. You use the top button to switch. There's the original iOS 4, console mode, and Android. Go ahead and select it, you hit the home button. It's going to show you all the processes it's going through. There's a little Android icon. Now one of the interesting things is it goes into a screen lock mode as soon as it finishes booting. But you know it's booting when you see the scrolling little uh, Android logo pop up. That one. Now I finished installing this version of the operating system at around 12.30 last night and played with it for a little while. When I first started it, the touchscreen would not work. Then after a reboot, the screen automatically started, the touch screen started to work again. So don't know whether or not that was just a system learn. Should be popping up in a moment. says no service because I don't have a valid SIM card in there. And here is a fully functioning droid. I don't have the wireless option here. I need to gain access to the network here at my workplace. Now the home button down below brings up the menu. The lock screen is the back button. little squirrely sometimes about phone model number iPhone 3G Android version 2.2.1 2 gotta love it sometimes so as you can see it is a pretty much functioning version of the Android operating system that's the default screen comes with it. Uh, let's see. The only issues I'm having with it, the time doesn't change automatically with the phone. You have to manually change it when you're setting it up. And the volume control here on the side does not control the volume. And even the, the sensors 
that's a screen lock. There we go. So it auto orient orientates itself. So if you have any questions, definitely search the web. I'm not in any sense or form or fashion a guru of this sort of thing so I don't have any other information other than I've just done this I'm still experimenting but it is possible sorry for all the fingerprints it's an iPhone you'll have to excuse me now if you excuse me I've got to get back to work